thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. I just wanted to jump in real quickly and let you know that I will be sharing with you what I packed. However, please note, I left Florida around 2.30 in the morning where I had only slept like maybe two hours. And we flew from Florida to Los Angeles. And it was a really long day because even when we landed at the airport, we still had a two and a half hour drive. So yeah, it was a long day. So if I sound like I'm a little tired in this video, listen, I was, I was. Hey guys, it's Felicia with Happily Ever After Living where I help women create and build their dream lives in a body that they love while on a budget that they can afford. So in today's video, what I wanted to do was share with you guys so, you guys, we are currently in California. We have plans to visit and hike Joshua Tree National Park, Sequoia and Kings, Sequoia and Kings Canyon National Park, um, Yosemite National Park, as well as visit Death Valley. So, in today's video, what I wanted to do was show you guys what I packed. You guys, this is literally like the easiest packing that I've ever done in my life and it just felt so good to be able to pack for a vacation and like not have to overthink it like you know sometimes when we go on cruises you got to think about what you want to wear like when you go when you get off the boat or whenever you I'm getting down on the floor or like whenever you have the um cab tonight or just any kind of vacation when you go visit friends or when you go into a wedding or you're going to visit family there's just so many other things to think about but all I had to think about was packing workout clothes and I love it and we're not even going to like a nice fancy dinner if we do we'll probably order it in or I'll wear like leggings and like a cute top or something <laughs> but I'm just gonna show you guys what I got I did not spend a lot of time on this I intended to do this video before I left um, Florida but, but in full transparency I worked like literally up until two hours before we left Got a little bit of sleep and then I had to get to the airport. So first, you know what? First I'll show you guys my luggage because I've had this forever and a day, not sponsored, but e-bags. Listen, if you see this video, you need to sponsor your girl. Here we go. So this is my e-bags carry-on. I'll actually link it down in the description box below. I love this bag. I've had it for years. The only thing that I don't like about this bag, and it wasn't a problem before, it's just that now, um, because there's so many more new bags on the market that have it where it like swivels, I think I would probably enjoy that. Yeah, as I was saying, I think I would enjoy the swivel feature like where you can like keep the bag right by you and turn it. With this, I still have to pull it. So that's the only thing I don't like about it. But let me share with you guys what I have inside. So in here, see how that opens up? Usually this is like packed to the brim, but not this time. Um, and also, this bag expands so if you need to make it a little bit larger you could there's also pockets here oh i put this bag in here in case i you know like wet clothes and stuff and then these compartments here but we don't need those this trip i'm telling you i pack super light and usually i would put like my phone or anything in here if i wasn't carrying another bag but i put those things in another bag so first i have my hiking bag because whenever we go hiking um, each day, I'll be putting my hiking gear in here. You guys know this is the G4 free. I'll list, I'll um, actually put the video where I did my first day hike with my boys with this bag. And I also put the link for this bag. My husband has the same one, but his is a little bit larger. So yeah, check that video out if you want to see what this bag looks like. Okay, so I like to use like I like to compartmentalize everything. So I think this e-bags packing cube, you guys see I love e-bags. Um, these are my underwear, so we're not gonna show that. Okay, so these are my underwear, but like over here I do have one set of pajamas. I packed two sets, but here's one set of pajamas. Um, let's see, let's just take all the bags out. So this is, um, this is a bag I got from a bra I bought a real bra you guys I don't know how to pronounce this or Cole anyways that brand the this bag came with the bra because you're not supposed to wash it like you're supposed to I guess it's delicate it better be it cost $78 but um yeah so anyways I just use the bag that I'm supposed to wash the bra in 
to pack my swimsuits so and sports bra so here's a sports bra and here's one of my swimsuits it's all black it's really cute let me find a better ca camera angle so this angle is not perfect but it is a little bit better so sports bra going from this bag again another pajama set this came from Target super cute I love it and a swimsuit this came from Shein 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 I'll link that video down below so yeah all of this fits inside of this little bag all that goes back in there and then I'll just zip it back up and tuck it back in my bag this swimsuit here it's just like a basic black swimsuit like a mom suit I think and I don't remember where I got this from I'm sorry it's by the brand Beach House I think I got it from some discount store maybe Bell's Outlet or Marshall something like that okay so in the bag we're taking this out first okay so in this bag I have more sports bras you guys I actually packed like two weeks early so some of the stuff I'm like yeah what did I put in there <laughs> So in here I have all of these. So we've got a white one, a black one, pink, and then like a purple color. And these all came from Target. Like here's this one, here's this one. I don't mind taking it out because I need to put these clothes, I need to put everything in the drawers anyways. So yeah, here's the black one. And then here's the white one. Oh, that's not showing up well. You get the gist. And in these, I ordered an extra large because I don't need these for, um, the, for me, these are not high impact. These are just for walks and hikes and things like that. So those all fit in here. Now this, I just tossed in here in case I decided I wanted to wear this. And then I'll show you guys in here. It's actually the last thing. It's also by eBags, the brand eBags. So this is actually all that I have. Like, is that not crazy? For seven days, this is all I packed. I'm so proud of myself. Let's see. Okay, so this is a really big trip for us. First of all, this is like my dream. I've wanted to be the girl that hikes and does yoga. You guys have heard me say that before in other videos. So um, one thing that we did with the kids was we gave each of them a national park to do research on and they presented it at dinner one night. And then another thing that we did was we allowed each person to choose a color for the day of like whatever day. So like today, we're all wearing blue because our youngest son chose blue. And then, so one day we're wearing olive green because my daughter chose that. But I wasn't sure if I wanted to wear this shirt or this one. And I will be wearing long sleeves every day even though it's incredibly hot because I burn. Oh my goodness. And I don't know what took me so long to learn to just put on longer sleeves and these um this one is by the brand layer eight it's really hard to find but try your marshall's or ross or like discount stores and this one is oh and i think this one's from amazon i'll link as much as i can down below for you guys my day of course is pink but we went with like a purple pinkish color I love this. <laughs> it's also by that same brand, layer eight. So this is what I'll be wearing. Our other son, our oldest son, chose red as his color. So I will be wearing this long sleeve Columbia shirt. And my husband chose camo. Um, so I will be wearing these camo shorts. These came from Amazon, actually. I'll link them below. And I'm not sure if I'll wear one of those olive green shirts or this shirt because, I don't know, like, camel is kind of, like, dark and stuff. And I feel like this would cheer me up a little bit. 
but I'll let you guys know which one I choose. And then I have these workout tops for the days that we're not hiking. I still need to work out, like because you guys know I'm on this 100 pound weight loss journey and I'm trying to stay committed to myself. So, and then the only other thing I packed, you guys, was I have leggings. Like, these are the ankle. Like, they come down to your ankle. I'll link them there by 90 degree. Um, so, one, two, three pair of um, Capri leggings. And then, oh, I lied. There's an extra pair. Because I don't know, like, each day if I want to wear... So each day, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to want to wear um, the Capri style leggings or shorts. So I did also pack shorts, biker shorts, same brand, and I have these. Yeah. So there's one, two, three, four pair. You can also get those from Amazon or you can get them from like Marshalls. These are the same brand, but just in a different color. I don't know, I just brought a different color in case I feel like I wanna do a little bit extra. Okay, now I'll show you guys what is in my other bag, which isn't a lot. So, this bag here is just for my um, electronics and toiletries. So, this is also my e-bags. Both of these bags are carry-on appropriate, approved, appropriate, whatever. And this bag I carry like a backpack. It's not too heavy, very supportive, I love it. And it has front pockets here, which I didn't need those for this trip. But you can keep like your wallet or things you want close to you right up front. But then I have my planner. <laughs> And then, let's see, I wanna get on top of this bag so you guys can see it. So it's not that organized. I just threw everything in here. Um, these were all of my last minute items. So in here is my um, like electronics bag. So everything I need like for my phone, um, for, videos like if I want to do any editing all of that's in there and then I have another pair of shoes here so I have these shoes those shoes and these shoes like that's it that's all I packed for this trip then I have a tripod for my phone so that we can get pictures at the park And then my raincoat. I was like, see how I hurt to put that back in there? Didn't even take my time. And toiletries, sunglasses, a little bit of makeup, not a lot. Like, I probably won't even use it. And extra headband. Oh, oh, so you guys, I got new sunglasses. Let me show you these. So I ordered these sunglasses, not sponsored from Amazon. So I had another pair of sunglasses that I found on clearance at Marshalls. And I put them on, my daughter was like, oh, you look like Stevie Wonder. <laughs> I put a picture here. So I was like, oh, that's not what I was going for. <laughs> so I told her to look on Amazon and find something that she thought would be nice for me because I wanted something that, um, would protect my eyes like being out in the sun for a long extended periods of time and this is what she came up with and the packaging for these were adorable I believe they were like $29 or something like that um, but they're like the polarizing sunglasses let's see how they look so not bad at all those are cute so i have those and then i'll show you guys real quickly what is in my cosmetic bag not a lot just a few little items so none of these are like brand specific i'm not like saying oh these are my favorite brands no these are 
are things I don't mind using and my goal is actually to probably use it all up and just be done with it this trip. So we've got some Suave Lotion, we've got some Olay Body Wash, Listerine, some Off um, Bug Repellent, and my husband also has the, the bands that you put on your arms, on your wrist. So we'll use those as well. And then this is some Black Girl um, Kit sunscreen. It is 50 SPF. So originally <laughs> I had a huge like Neutrogena Beach something that was like 70 SPF, I believe. But I looked at the ounces on it and I was like, uh oh too much so thankfully i was able to find two of these at marshall's and this is what we'll put on our body and then my daughter has um a smaller size neutrogena like just for the face that is 70 spf and this one like i may have mentioned was 50. and then here is some dove deodorant michael kors perfume toothbrush travel size toothbrush toothpaste and a pen I always need a pen and yeah that's all I actually packed for this um, trip oh and I also like in here I have a highlighter and I have my planner because my brain is always going um, but yeah that's all I packed for this trip and everyone in our family everyone has their own toiletries bag it just makes it so much easier and they just give you guys a little tip so for our boys, what I did was I created a list for them and because they already chose like what days they wanted to wear, what color, I basically said like Monday, blue shirt, actually, here's our, here's our itinerary. <laughs> so like they know that on Friday we're blue, Saturday we're pink, they know what day to wear, red, green camo etc um and then i just put like i gave them a ziploc bag for each day and each so each day they put in a shirt a bottom underwear a pair of socks like keep it simple and then um also they had to pack two pair of pajamas and two swim trunks sneakers and um one pair of sandals to wear like around the resort and then their toiletry bag which dad helped with that and oh so they carried a Jansport book bag with all of that and then their little hiking bag which had their electronics and snacks for the plane the little stuff and it's a small little bag you guys if you guys should go look at my um my first day hike with my boys that little bag is what they carry like those small things in so yeah, I hope this video wasn't too long. Um, I'm really looking forward to this trip. This is something that I've been looking forward to for a long time. You guys, I simply started my journey with walking two miles a day, then bumping it up to trying to do 10,000 steps a day. And now one year later to be hiking. Like I'm literally going to hike a lot this week. Like that is my life now. Uh, can't believe it. All right, guys, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Now I gotta clean all this mess up. <laughs>